I found that the Ann Arbor Public Schools and the people in the communities really want to help. And when there is a need, people step up. Our community is rich with a variety of resources to support our students. And yet, understanding where to find resources and how to best use them can be a daunting task. This video will provide you with a quick overview of how AAPS staff can connect students and families to community resources. Community resources are defined as any external resource from a group, organization, or individual outside of your school community that can provide support for AAPS students and families. This support typically fills a gap or supplements existing school supports and may include basic needs, emergency needs, academic support, mental health support, and more. Community resources are typically provided by a local nonprofit organization or government agency and are free or offered at a very low cost. Let's go over the ways that you can access community resources in three easy steps. Step one, check your school resources first. It truly takes a village to raise a child at AAPS. At every school, there are often many staff working to support a student, depending on the student's situation. Before reaching out to the AAPS Strategic Partnerships Office or to a community resource, check with your school community. Start with your principal, social worker, counselor, or other support staff. If you have a TLN, Teaching and Learning Network, or group email with staff in your same role, this is also a great place to start. School PTOs can also offer financial and in-kind support for student needs. We had a refugee family come to the U.S. with nothing, and I was scrambling to get them the items that they needed, and our district EL coordinator suggested that I reach out to the PTO and school community. And sure enough, people really wanted to help, and through the generosity of other families, we got every item covered. Step two visit a2schools.org slash community resources. Can't find someone in your school community to assist? Check out the AAPS Community Resources webpage. This webpage, located in the Students and Family section of a2schools.org, lists reputable community resources that staff, students, and families can access to support students. Feel free to reach out to one of the resources listed or share the resource with your student or family member. Washtenaw County is resource enriched environment. So we're able to find resources for just about anything here in Washtenaw County. Step three, email the district community resources team. Still can't find what you're looking for? Email our district community resources team made up of social workers, counselors, nurses, EL teachers, and other staff and ask a question. DST underscore community underscore resources at aaps.k12.mi.us. Please note that this email group is for staff use only. So a student who had moved here, very complicated family situation. She had not seen a dentist for about four years. We were able to connect her with through the social worker with a grant to have her teeth looked at and taken care of. And that's very gratifying. It takes a team of knowledgeable staff just like you to support our AAPS students. We hope this video helped increase your understanding of community resources and where to go to quickly find help. You will find an overview of these three steps and more on the four staff page at a2schools.org slash community resources. We truly couldn't do this work of supporting our students and families in the Ann Arbor schools without our strong connections to our community and school resources. I've never worked in another district, but I'm very happy to work in Ann Arbor because it's been so easy to find resources once you connect with the people. Frequently, we can walk away feeling like we've made a difference. It's part of the reason I love my job. Thank you for supporting our students and families in the Ann Arbor Public Schools.